Hey everyone, this is Natasha from Makeup and SFC. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing a haul. So if you don't follow me on social media, then you need to. I will list them down below. But if you didn't see already, I got invited to the Ipsy cocktail party and I got this huge swag bag. I'm sure everybody and their mom will be showing their video, but in case you wanted to see what I got, I don't know, you can take a look. I know that everybody will be uploading theirs and so I just wanted to extend a huge thank you to Ipsy, Jen Beauty, Michelle Fawn, Lynette Sine. These people have been very supportive in my YouTube little bubble here and I cannot thank them enough because none of this would be possible without them. And so I got invited to the cocktail party last minute and I was able to attend it. It was in the Terry Gallery in San Francisco down in Soma. And so a few of my friends were able to go. So we were happy to hang out and see everybody and kind of experience this thing again. Um, the last time I had done it was in LA. And if you remember my vlog, I was not happy because of the turn of events. But in the long run, I made the Gen Beauty two day event the best that it could be and so i really think that if you are someone who you know can join the community the ipsos community i highly recommend it because i mean they've been nothing but helpful for you know creating your channel your brand and creating this network of people that just enjoy makeup and beauty every time i go to one of these events i really feel focused and inspired and hungry for more and so sometimes it makes me think hey maybe I will quit my job and try to do this this thing full time but then I'm like no I'm a teacher at heart and so I will continue to teach you how to do makeup and how to you know take care of your skin and how to live a happy healthy life but other than that, we're just gonna have fun and play with makeup. Okay, so if you're interested in this makeup look, I just did a tutorial. It was the makeup that I wore at Gen Beauty, so I will list that down below. And if you're interested in this hat, I will find the link and I will put it down below. I think I got it on eBay. But yes, this is far too long of an intro. Let's get started. I kind of opened it already is this Royal and Lang Nickel uh, brush set. Now, this looks so cool. I mean, the set alone probably costs a lot, um, but it's 100% vegan, no animal products were used, and they are a pro quality brush kit. It comes in this case, just like that. It smells like factory, but it looks very luxe, and it's good for traveling. I really like these hard cases when traveling. If you can fit it into your luggage. Um, I think it's a great way to travel and then you can create these little cups like when you're setting them on a table. It comes with a various amount of brushes. It looks like we have a good mix of eye and face brushes. If you'd like to see a tutorial with me using these, please comment down below and I'd be happy to show you. I will find the set from the website and link it down below as well as their prices so that you can see the overall value of this bag. But yes, uh, moving on. The next thing I got is this Laneige water sleeping mask. Now I've been stocking this mask at my local Target, but every time I try to get it, it is always freaking sold out. And I'm so excited that I get a full size. Thank you. Thank you, Laneige. Thank you, Ipsy. Um, and I have an idea, but I think I'm gonna try to do this tonight. But I wanted to film like a Gen Beauty detox recuperation video because when you do gem beauty you wear makeup like every day and it's a lot on your face so i think a recuperating video would be awesome so this is fabulous i'm so excited to try this it's an overnight revitalizing gel mask so i love sleeping masks um all of the asian brands like to do them and so you sleep with the mask on and all of the benefits just sink into your skin and you wake up with some bomb face action yes I feel like a baby on Christmas Day all right so this is from pure lease ah pure lease so pure lease is a really great brand the owner used to be 
the Pink Ranger, I think. My friend Jason just told me that. I will confirm and place it right here if that is the fact that he did share. Um, and so this is made with Blue Lotus and it is said to be a powerful antioxidant known for its anti-inflammatory benefits. And so white tea also rejuvenates the skin. Soy milk is rich in amino acids, which helps with the elasticities in your face and white whole oat, excuse me, calms and soothes sensitive skin. So this 4-in-1 cleansing milk is for taking off all of the stuff on your skin. I don't know that I would use this to take off my makeup. It does. It gently cleanses makeup, tones, and soothes the skin. So it's for all skin types. And so I love cleansing oils, but I've not used a cleansing milk. Oh, that is not what I thought it was going to be in. I thought it was going to be in like a little pumpy tube thing, but uh, this is even better. So it's in a squeezy tube and I'm excited to use this. You have no idea. Oh, and it's a big bottle. This is five ounces. Holy crap. Okay. The next one is perfect. A cleansing oil. So you know how much I love cleansing oils. I've used the Garnier Fructis one, which got discontinued. Now this is from DHC. So I cleanse with an oil and then I wash with a face wash, usually a foaming face wash. And, oh, it's so pretty. And that's it right there. It is, ooh, made in Japan. It's 6.7 fluid ounces. We are set. Guys, we've made it big. We've made it big. Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. So the next thing in my bag is a Rock Your Hair. It is called the Spray It Clean Dry Shampoo. I actually have the hairspray right there and a smaller version of this sitting on my desk right now. And I really do like this brand. It is definitely intense. Like it doesn't make your hair crispy, but it does have extreme hold if you use the hairspray. The dry shampoo is really good. It smells, um, I can't smell it right now and I'm too afraid to spray it into my eyes. Um, but it's really affordable too. Like I remember at Gen Beauty in LA, like the tube was $5. Um, he gifted it to me when I had gone to the booth. So I'm happy to have a full size of this now. So Milani was there. And Milani, I, I wish I would have gone to Milani. I didn't have time to visit the booth. It was so popular, but they gave us a metallic lipstick. Um, I own a ton of Milani uh, Amore mattes, and I also have not tried this, so I'm excited to do that. And it's perfect for fall because it's kind of a copper collar right now. Yay! I met Makeup Legend Dinner, Lisa, here on Instagram, and she always has these on her Instagram. Like, she is on top of it. All right, so the next thing I got, I know there's two of these. Okay, so I got these Physician Formula. Oh, this is what happens when your hands are small. Okay, so I got the Physician's Formula Insta Ready Super BB. So this is the BB cream, which has SPF 30, and then this is the bronzer highlighter. It's a contour trio stick. I don't really buy into these because it's kind of like you you swipe it all at once and it's supposed to do everything. But of course, you know, that's not entirely possible, but we're gonna try it. And, um, you know, Physician's Formula is one of those brands where it's all about um, the health benefits of using them, so we're interested. These are not cheap. It, just, Physician's Formula is always expensive, so I'm happy to have gotten that. I have a Derma E Purifying Daily Detox Scrub. I've used the purifying mask, and so I'm happy to try this. I'm a sucker for skincare, so I'm excited about using this. The new product line design is beautiful. So when you start seeing that in stores, feel luxurious because it looks like a spa. All right. So I love Shea Moisture. I love the African Black Soap line. If you've watched my channel, you know that I always recommend that. And so they have a beauty line that I have not tapped into. I really want to try the foundations and the concealers, but I will get to that. But they gifted us 
this mineral eyeshadow palette which can be used wet or dry and this one is in the shade volcanic stone so i really like those colors i think it's perfect for winter it's got a cool tone to it and i can just create smoky looks so i'm excited to see what the pigmentation is like and I love the names, Rock Crystal, Druzy, Sunstone, Rochelle, Linnea, and Onyx. So that's nice. Good for traveling. Okay. Okay. Skin Fix. I love Skin Fix. So I like the lightweight moisturizer. I use that in the wintertime. And then I do like their hand cream. And they do have like lip balms. And so this is the Renewing Cream. So this is for rough and bumpy. Which sometimes I can get texture on the outside of my arms. So this would be interesting to use. It's clinically proven to smooth, dry, rough, bumpy skin. And Keratosis Pilaris. Oh. Dash Fancy. Oh, chicken skin. Yeah. I should let my cousins use this. They call it chicken skin. That's sad. Why would they do that? I don't know. But I will have them try this and see if they find it effective. But I will also use it too. Mine's not as severe, but I can feel it pop up sometimes. But yes, that would be good to try. So Tarte gifted the Tardis. This is the Lash Paint Mascara. I have not tried this, so that will be fun to do. Pixie by Petra gave us the Large Mascara. So this is from Target, it's very affordable. So I like the brush, it looks very voluminous, so I'm excited to try that. Zibom gave us the La Bomba. This is Steel the Spotlight. It is a, I looked at this, it's like a four pan eyeshadow palette. So that's pretty cute, nice shimmery tones and then a taupe shade for the crease. Yes, yes. The Bomb always has really cute packaging. La Bamba. All right. The NYX folks gave us this cute little bag right here. And inside is a bunch of stiff. All right. We have the lip of the day. It looks like a, you know how when people do the lips, they do like some graphic liner on it. This is in the shade Gem. Gem. It's called Gem. <laughs> I could read. It was about to be French and I was like, I can't do that. Pierre. Okay. So here's a little NYX card hoping that we enjoy. Now I'm excited about this. This is the Love Contours All palette. And so my friend Veronica raved about it because they received it at Gen Beauty New York. So it has like all of these face powders, but it also has eyeshadows and brow powders. So I'm excited to use this in a video. Go ahead and comment down below if you're interested in that. Yes. And then I also got two pigments. So I have this really nice silver pigment. Ooh, This is called Magnetic. And then this is called... Are you called Metallic? Metallic Velvet. So this one's more of a purple burgundy. Oh, it's kind of like a blue-brown pigment. Pregnant? Pigment. I can see kind of like that purple and blue um, micro glitter in it. Yes, Nyx. Yes. And then I have two. These are the Turned Up. Where <laughs> They come up with the funniest names. They kind of look like the high voltage lipsticks, but just renamed. But yes, I got these two. One is called Feline, which is more of a burgundy red. And then the other one is called Beam. And it's more of a like juicy pink. Well, I don't know what color I was saying. The GHD people gave us a coupon for 20% off to get our own products. I did not get to do my concierge opportunity where people got to go around the booths and then possibly talk to the companies to get product. I am not that cool, but I will list some people down below who got to do that, and then they'll hopefully make videos about it. So go check them out. So this is from Vital Proteins. The reps are super nice. I met them at the cocktail party, and um, this is collagen peptides. And so it is a natural anti-aging dietary supplement. Now, if you use um, protein powder when you're working out, this is kind of the same concept, except instead of gaining muscle, um, you're gaining anti-aging properties. So I'm definitely gonna look into this because I do like a good protein shake or um, I'll see if it works making protein pancakes. Um, 
But yeah, I like nice hair and nails and uh, keeping my bones healthy because Asian women are more prone to getting osteoporosis. Fact. All right. Um, from OGX. <laughs> so glamorously packaged um, in a saran wrap. I mean, in a plastic bag. I got the Weightless Oil Lifting Tonic, which is perfect because my hair gets very weighed down easily, so I don't put any product in it at too often. Um, so this looks like it is a um, gravity-defying and hydrating spray. Biotin, I like the purple one, and so I get that in the big bottle all the time. All right, I also got it looks like the Generation Beauty also gave us 40% off of the Spin Brush. It's not actually in here, but the Spin Brush from Blend Smart. Blend Smart. From Blend Smart. So in case I want to buy that, it's in there. From Luxie, we got a five-piece brush set, I think. It is a synthetic brush set. And they are all pretty much kabuki style, so they're still wrapped up. And they have their little brush um, brush shields on them. I'm excited to use those. Now, from Pop Beauty, we got the Permanent Pout. So I'm thinking this is a liquid lipstick. And it is in the shade Pink Power, which should be super fun to wear. This is actually very huge. It's almost the size of a mascara. And that is an electric pink. Mm -hmm. So... That should be fun to wear. They are signature for their pops of color. So that is super fun. Benefit gave us a full size Their Real Mascara. I've only had samples of this. Um, I may pass this along or try it on. I have tons of mascaras now. I think I'm good. Now, let's see, from Absolute New York. I wanna say Absolute like the, the drink, but I'm sure it's Absolute. We got these fluid eyeshadows, and they're in a little pack of four. Right now, they are bound in this little tiny bag, and I cannot untie it. Um, but I got cute little colors. They're metals, and I have it in a what looks like a copper, a burgundy, a purple, and a black. So that'll be nice to put as an eyeshadow base, or maybe on its own. So Mimi Box and a brand called Bon Vivant had this little package in it, and it looks amazing. So here we have this really cute ear headband. Got to put it on. Cause how stinking cute. They all wore these actually at the event. Uh yes. Yeah. That's a keeper. We have this, it looks like a buffing sponge. It is in Korean, but it looks like a sponge that you can use to exfoliate. We also have a paddle brush that will be used to put on your masks because we got three full-size masks, homie. These are from Bon Vivant, and it is a botanical mellow clay mask. A botanical mellow clay mask. Oh my God, they're all mellow clay masks, but they're all different. How are they different? I don't know, they're in Korean. <laughs> they should have given us little descriptions in English. Why are they different? I'm gonna have to do some research on them and find out why they're different, but I got three of them. <laughs> and then I got a ton of face masks. You can never have too many of these. I love sheet masks and I constantly have like at least five of them in rotation ready to go whenever I need to do one if I'm willing I will try to do one a day um oh and these are in English so this one says blemish care this says brightening care this says hydrating care niacinamide and lime this one is a Denosine and acai berry. This is chamomile and tea tree oil. This is collagen and olive. Sodium hyaluronate and lotus. Madicasicide. Madicasicide. And mugwort. 
That sounds like Harry Potter like. Yes. And last but not least, we have our bag from Jouer. Now I love Jouer's cream highlighters. I got that from the last Gen Beauty, but I have not tried everything that is in this bag. Oh, hello. He gave us a little card. But this makeup bag is so freaking cute. It's pink, it's beautiful, it's luxe. And then inside of a makeup bag is another makeup bag that included four of their, um, actually five, one is over there in my purse. It is their long wear lip cream and we got four, bleh, we got five different shades. I think I'm gonna swatch these and put them on my vlog, my blog. And then we also got the Glisten Brightening Powder. And so that looks like either full size or a really good deluxe size. And then inside we got these cute little brushes. So this is a perfect little bag to travel with. Um, inside is all velvety, so I don't know if I'll put my like dirty things in here, but it's a really great bag. And I think that is the end. No, it's not, there's more. Okay, so going to the booth, I didn't go too, too much into um, the lines and stuff. I'm gonna keep this on the rest of the freaking video. All right, so from Pinky Rose and Crown Brushes, uh, the owners of Pinky Rose were there, the three sisters, and they were so stinking cute. And they gifted me these lashes right here from their brand. And so I'm going to be happy to use these in a video. They also gave me their new liquid lipstick and then another lipstick. But in the excitement of everything, I dropped it. And I think someone stole them from me. But whatever. Anyway, it's all good because the liquid lipstick will go to a happy person who probably needed it more than me. Um, but... I'm excited to try those. I worked at the NYX booth, and so NYX gave us a bunch of swag after working. And so I don't wanna go through everything, but I'll just go through some. Um, I got this Conceal and Correct palette. I actually have this already. I got this Fly With Me, no. Yeah, Fly With Me mascara. I got, ooh, colored mascara. We got purple, we got um, this butter lipstick, I have this one too. I got, ooh, a jumbo eye pencil. Those are classic NYX products. I got the Wicked uh, lashes. I've never tried NYX lashes, but those look interesting. They look a little long, so I'll probably be able to trim them. I got this cream contour kit and highlight in the shade Deep. All right. More NYX pencils. I got a NYX liquid lip suede in the shade, I think this is Kitten Heels. Yes, it is. So that might be going to give away because I already have that color. Matte lipstick in the shade, Zen Orchid. Ooh, I've never tried their brow cakes. This is in the shade Taupe Ash, which might be nice if I want a more natural brow. Another vintage. I wore this actually when I worked at the NYX booth. I love this color. I got some prismatic eyeshadows in the shade Golden Peach and I'm glad I've never bought these because now I have them. Okay, a lip, this is a lip cream, Simply Nude in Honey. And then, ooh, a corrector. I've actually gotten this for my mom, but it's nice to have one of my own. I have a Propel My Eyes mascara. I didn't know NYX had so many mascaras. I got some more lip products. We're gonna go through this forever. Oh, this is way too much product. Raya. Okay, then from Pixie, I got this eyeshadow palette in the shade, what is this called? Amethyst Aura. Nice purples, that'll be pretty. Eye Bright Kit in the shade Medium Tan. Sweet, because I'm usually medium tan. Here's another Pinky Rose product. It is a sponge for blending. YouTuber SL Miss Glam, she created her own cosmetic brush or tool line and so she gave us a sponge and a brush. I also got a brush in my bag. There it is. So I have two of these and they're awesome. Little blending brushes. I got this Pure Triple Threat Slimline Mascara. That's also from my bag. And I got a Crown Brush Mascara. I'm stacked on mascaras. I don't know whose idea this was but I don't know. Okay, so Veronica actually 
stayed over my place. I will list my vlog up here. But she gave me two of the Meet Matt Hughes lipsticks in Adoring and Sincere because she actually had all of them and I have never tried them. So thank you, Veronica. I also have this Tarte BB. This is Shape Tape. I bought this at the um, booth for 15 because it was super on sale. And so this is in the shade, I think, Medium. Yep, just straight up medium. So I'm excited to use that. Yes. I got another little mini water bank mask from Laneige. So that's so cute for traveling. I got this Batter Up eyeshadow stick in the shade Shout Out from The Balm. I got a TARDIS lip paint in the shade Fortune, which is supposed to be a nice brown. So that will be cute. Uh-huh. Some nude sticks, Taylor gave us two of their eye pencils, and these are the sheer colors, so they are shimmery. I chose the shimmery ones because I think I had all the other colors, so I'm excited to try those. And then from Skin Fix, we got this Natural Lemon Mint Lip Repair Balm. I'm all about the balms. 25% off, yes. From Pop, we got these eyeliner pencils, and so they look like a cute little gift. And it comes in basic colors that you always need, like a white, a nude, a silver, black, and brown. Cool, thanks, Pop. From Jouer, I actually got two of their lip toppers. So I got the shades Tan Line and Skinny Dipping, so I cannot wait to use these two. They're really pretty colors. All right, all right, I'll open them and show you. <laughs> we are almost done. I feel it. Do you feel it? Ooh, yes. We got a Luxie eye brush. I actually have this brush, but they're really good for people with small eyelids. I have a pen that I stole from a booth. Sorry. Then from Benefit, we got the Gimme Brow. This is in the shade 3. I think I might be 5 or 6, but I will make this work. It is gel for your eyebrow, and it kind of fills it in. From Ava NYC, we got a hair mask. I've gotten those before. And that is the end, fellas. We did it, we got it all. So again, thank you to Jen Beauty for hooking a sister up. Thank you Ipsy, thank you Michelle Fawn, thank you Lynette Sine, thank you to my friends who made this experience the best days that I've had in a really long time and I cannot wait for the next one. Now, I did feel some serious FOMO when I didn't go to New York, but I'm so happy that my latest Gen Beauty was San Francisco because it was so nice to see everybody in the city and excited about the city. So, yes, I hope Gen Beauty comes back and I will see you in my next video. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe down below and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.